I love it. I love it. Wow. <laughs> I love it. Look at this. This is, this is the greatest thing I've ever seen. Hey, I'm not surprised. Hey, what's up my homies? You know what time it is. It's not time for a smoke break. It's time for the alien. And it's time to, you know, smoke break throughout the whole video too. Obviously, nothing more to fear. The alien is here. Let's go. All right, we've got Charlie Rosa taking on Damon Jackson. Now, both of these guys are jujitsu fighters. You know, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, Mixed Martial Arts. They both like to use the, the Jiu-Jitsu. Who is the alien going to predict? Let's skip it. Damon Jackson, let's go. And it takes the leech, let's go. We're sparking back up already. Alexander Romanov taking on Jared Vandera. And the alien has Alexander Romanov minus 800 nearly. Yeah, okay. The alien hasn't been partying this week. And guys, we're going to try to keep the blunt for this whole video. Because the fight card is only 9 fights. And it's even less fights to simulate with the alien. So yeah, we're going to keep the blunt lit the whole video. Alright, so Chris Gutierrez taking on Felipe Colares. I'm going to say decision for Chris Gutierrez. And the AI predicts. That's what's up. That is what's up, alien. No partying this week. All right, moving on into Maria Agapova and Sabina Mazo. Now, if the AI takes my prediction on this one, Maria Agapova. Oh, man, plus 350 on Maria. I've got a feeling the AI is going to disagree this time. And it does. All right, I'm happy to disagree on women's MMA. All right, Tim Elliott taking on Matthias Nicolau. I would love the AI to predict Tim Elliott on this one. Minus 400 for the veteran. And the blunt's still lit. Let's go. And it's... Yo, AI. Alien. Let me show the live pictures again, bro. Alright, Randy Rudeboy Brown taking on Jared Gooden. My prediction is going to be Randy Brown. But Jared Gooden has a nasty right hand. We don't want to see that. Yeah, let's go. I am one with the AI. I am one with the alien. All right, main event. We've got Marina Rodriguez taking on Mackenzie Dern. A lot of people siding with the striking. A lot of people siding with that round one sub, round two sub. Man, a sub at any time. You know, Mackenzie Dern can be getting beat the whole fight. And it just takes one takedown and it's probably going to be over. But yeah, it is a 50-50 matchup in my opinion. And the alien knows that. Look at these betting lines. Yeah, let's go alien. All right, we're going to start the timer. Is the blunt still lit? That's the question. It's not. I failed two times to keep the blunt lit. Oh, what's this? A takedown already? So according to the AI... Mackenzie Dunn did get the fight to the map, but there's not been a submission yet. Man, so we're midway into round two. No submission yet for Mackenzie Dunn. Does she get a takedown? Yes, she does. Man, I do feel like if this matchup, you know, goes into deep waters, it is going to go more towards Marina Rodriguez, in my opinion. You know, the alien says Mackenzie Dunn is, you know, attempting these submissions, but Marina Rodriguez apparently defending. Oh man, what's this? A submission. Round four. Oh my goodness, I disagree, AI, and I'm scared now. All right, man, there you have it. It's another main event disagreement with the AI, and I don't feel good about it. So we've got Damon Jackson, which is a nice prediction. Alexander Romanov, nice prediction. Chris Gutierrez, nice prediction. Sabina Mazo, which was the alien's first disagreement. Tim Elliott. Randy Brown and the main event, the alien went with Mackenzie Dern submission. All right, my homies, we're going to find out what happens with these AI predictions tomorrow night. As always, man, I appreciate you for watching these videos. All right, peace.
Thank you.